Columbia Falls knows who they are. They put their hearts and souls into this community. Once we started living here and became a part of the community, I, I feel really blessed that we picked this town. I'm used to living in a small town. I like to live in a small town. How can you not love it? I mean, you look out the window, how can you not love it? And it's the community, it's the people, it's definitely the people. Columbia Falls people, there's just something, something down home, warm, caring, loving about the people here. Columbia Falls is just a great place to live and I uh, intend on uh, living here as, as long as I'm around. This is the best place to live. I've been in Columbia Falls all my life. I was born and raised here. Uh, I was born here and both my parents were born here as well. I've lived in Columbia Falls about 20 years. Almost 30 years. 10 years. 31 years. 49 years. Well, you know, I've lived here my whole life. 18 years. I moved here a couple years ago. I'm going on 10 years now. About three years. I've been born and raised and stayed here the whole time. It's the perfect size community. It's extremely safe. It's walkable. So despite the protest for my teenage children, you can walk anywhere in this community. Columbia Falls is just a very small, tight-knit community. Just everybody kind of watches out for everybody else and it's just a great place to raise kids. It's that small town feeling you walk around anytime, day or night, feel perfectly comfortable and safe. We have our kids riding their bicycles all over town, uh, from one side of town to the other, just like it was when I was growing up in the 50s and 60s, and that just is a, a real comforting feeling. It's a quiet community. It's relaxing. It's a relaxing place to live. You're used to seeing a lot of familiar faces, and it's definitely still a very small town atmosphere. You know, you can go to the grocery store and run into 30 people that you know. <laughs> In the annual events, Heritage Days in the summer and the Night of Lights in the winter um, really bring the community together. We've always been the most affordable place to live in the valley. We have here every level of home. You know, you've got your starter home to those multi-million dollar mansions. You get a lot of bang for your buck in this community. Uh, people are nice. When it's nice here, weather-wise, it's, it's as nice as uh, it is. Nicer than anywhere. It's just beautiful. It's a beautiful place. And if I was starting out with a family, I would choose Columbia Falls. I've always said that the strongest part of our school system is our children. There's something special about our kids. We have outstanding, strong academic schools with wonderful music, speech and debate, and, and strong athletics. Our athletic programs, as I said, have been fairly successful over the years, and they are a focal point for our community. I can't think of a better place for anyone's children to attend school. Gold Slumber is the oldest privately owned sawmill forest products company in Montana. We recently celebrated our 100th birthday. F.H. Uh, Stoltz, our founder, came out with the Great Northern Railway a little before the turn of the century and built a sawmill on this exact location in 1912. So, a lot of history, um, been here a long time. Hopefully we're here another 100 years. Got uh, Plum Creek here and do, uh, you know, boards, plywood, MDF. They're the biggest employer. They're still largely timber products. Uh, we have, of course, two million visitors going through to Glacier Park every year. But I'll, our uh, small businesses would tell you whether it's Steve Markison at the Night Owl or Lori's at Lori's Deli, that the local economy makes up the cake and the tourists are just the frosting. That it's the, the local patronage that keeps them in business. 
You could open a small business here, or you could open your business elsewhere in the valley and just commute. We decided to try to start our own business. Some of falls felt right. We have a lot of business contacts here. Everyone wants to see more business come to Coney Falls and really Montana in general. There's lots of outdoors activities that you can enjoy here in the Flathead or in Coney Falls. I do enjoy being so close to outdoors. It takes two minutes to walk out your back door and you can be at 10, 15 different lakes. There's all kinds of hikes right around here. The river, everybody loves to float in the summertime. Going up the North Fork, rafting, fishing, camping. And you just felt like, like I was 12 again. You're just like whoosh, flying down these bike paths and you're just like shooting up at the mountains. This is freaking awesome. I can't believe we live here. <laughs> this is fun. And now we have this beautiful park that you don't even have to leave town. You can walk to a 27 acre park and enjoy the Flathead River in the wide open space without even having to get in your car. Then wintertime is also if you're a skier, snowboarder, I mean this is a great place to be. You can leave your house and in a half hour you can be on the hill ready to go. You know there's a lot of skiers, so obviously they're using Blacktail and uh, Whitefish Mountain. Columbia Falls, we are the gateway to recreation outdoors. two million visitors every summer to Glacier National Park and they come from all over the country and all over the world to do what I do and other people in Columbia Falls what we do in you know in less than a half hour. If you like to hunt, if you like to fish, hike, run rivers, photography, paint, Columbia Falls is the place to be. It's the hometown feeling that Columbia Falls has is the reason why I live here. For some reason we're blessed as far as the quality of our students and, and the character of our students. You, I can't get over the scenery, you know. I have yet to find anything that's better than this. And this is Columbia Falls, and there is just that very strong pride and ownership in, in being from Columbia Falls. We are still where people are going to want to live, and I see that continuing in the future.